difference between compound and simple interest on rupees 5000 for 2 years at the same rate as rupees 72 the rate of interest per annum is here rate is common for compound and simple interest let us consider rate as r percentage rate as r here now simple interest is same for every year so in the first year rate is equal to r percentage principal is equal to 5000 i will write it as 5k so r percentage of 5000 is added as simple interest for the first year in the second year same interest is added that is rate is r percentage principal is 5000 so r percentage of 5000 is added as the simple interest for the second year now total interest is this one now compound interest compound interest for the first year is same as the simple interest for the first year because here rate is common R percentage is the rate and principal is 5000. In the first year, there is no previous year. So, interest for interest is not possible for the first year. So, R percentage of 5000 is the compound interest for the first year. In the second year, rate is R percentage and principal is 5000 plus extra interest on interest of previous years is added to the next year. Here, previous year interest is r percentage of 5000 this is the interest received on the previous year or last year last year interest here is only r percentage of 5k so here we need to add r percentage of rate is r percentage and previous year interest is equal to r percentage of 5000 so r percentage of r percentage of 5000 is added to the compound interest for the second year now here you can see compound interest is r percentage of 5k plus r percentage of r percentage of 5000 so this is the difference between simple interest and compound interest now you can see if you take the difference between simple interest and compound interest this one and this one cancel this one and this one cancel remaining is r percentage of r percentage of 5k because compound interest means interest on the interest of the previous years is added to the next year now here you can see difference between compound interest and simple interest is rupees 72 so this one is equal to 72 r percentage of r percentage of 5000 is equal to 72 here i will cancel double zero and percentage percentage means 1 by 100 so this 10 zero and 10 zero in 1 by 100 that is remaining is 1 by 10 so this 5 goes 2 times in 10 then r square by 2 is equal to 72 means r square is equal to 72 into 2 that is 144 if r square is 144 that means r is equal to 12 that is r is equal to 12 percentage option b is your answer